Welcome to our first DIY project today. I'm Abraham and you're watching Iraqi Tech Geek. Today's project is Instagram Fellows Counter, a small device covered in wood that you can place on your desk. It shows how many followers you have on Instagram and it updates every 30 minutes. The project is quite simple. You don't need to be an expert in coding because all the codes will be linked in the description. The things you need for this project are Max 7219 LED Matrix Display Node MCU ESP8266 with Wi-Fi module Female to female jumper wires Micro USB cable And some wood I will leave the links in the description Take the precise measurements of the LED display so we won't have any unneeded space. The height is 32 millimeters and the length is 130 millimeters. Add an extra millimeter to avoid mistakes. Cut the wood in 45 degree angle using a saw to make the front frame. Then use wood glue to stick it together. Let it dry, then start working on the body and the back. Not too bad, huh? I added four layers of coating to the box. I wanted it to have a darker color with a semi-acrylic reflection. Let it dry between each layer. Fit the display screen in front of the frame. Make sure to connect the pins correctly. The instructions will be displayed later in this video. Use some hot glue and adjust the alignment with your fingers. Drill a hole in the box for the USB cable. Don't make it too big. You can use any type of glue, but in this video, I will use hot glue to stick the box into the front frame. Follow the instructions on how the connections are made. Each side shows where the wires should go.
plug the USB and glue the Node MCU inside the box. Don't make it touch the screen. Then use some glue to cover the back side of the box. To get a better shape, use the remaining parts of the wood to make a small stand that tilts the screen to have a better look at it. Use hot glue to stick them to the front frame. Let's start coding. After you plug the device into the USB port in your PC or laptop, right click on Start menu and choose Device Manager. Go to Ports and look at the port number. It doesn't matter what port it displays, as we will select that from the Arduino coding software later. Open the file that you've downloaded and open up the Instagram file. If you don't recognize any of those libraries, make sure to check out my other video where I explain how to install libraries on your Arduino software. Go to Tools, then select the board from the menu, which should be ESP8266. Then go to the bottom of the list and make sure the port that you select matches the port that we saw earlier. Now look at the codes and change the username string to your Instagram ID. Scroll down and add your Wi-Fi SSID and password. Then click on Verify to verify the code. After the progress bar finishes loading, click on Upload. You will notice the screen start connecting and loading data from the internet. Then the number should display correctly. It's a nice looking addition at your desk. It looks amazing. But let me know in the comments what do you think and help me to get to a thousand subscribers so I can start working on Mark II which has weather, clock, date, and also plays your music using voice commands. Thank you very much for watching and I will see you next video.